Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Imperator Rome. Well, would you look at this? There is an Elbacorian revolt again. I mean, I guess part of the problem is that I keep wiping out their armies. But still, it like really, really angers me that, that you get these guys as a feudatory. They immediately have a revolt, and the revolt frees them of your feudator the feudatory status. I mean, it's a revolt. It's not like these are these are completely new people. Just, mm, I don't know if this gets changed in the upcoming patch. All right, so you are not my feudal feudatory anymore. I am just going to fabricate a claim. What exactly do I need again? Aritium. That has a fort now? Oh, yuck. Uh, let's go ahead and support Asturian interests. It's gonna create some unrest, but that's fine. Okay. Uh, influence actions, threaten war. I can't actually threaten a war for Aritium. Of course not. Alright. Alright, so I need to get these guys up to um, 18. Positive 18, then I can get out, I think. Yeah, a little bit more. There we go. Alright, so a war against you would uh, bring in Kinetia, which I'm not too worried about. Bletonesia again. Tartessia. Tartessia is a little bit of a worry. Altragonia is a worry because they haven't been involved in anything. And Kiliconia. Alright, you know what? Uh, let's get someone there. Get someone there. You there. You up there. You over here. And army maintenance, fort maintenance. Uh, tribal chief offers friendship. Um, yeah, it could be useful. That's fine. So, I'm going to be going to war, basically, right away. Um, we're really not that high on... Uh, you know, uh, war exhaustion, so I'm not too concerned about that. Child is born, a daughter. Get in prison. So I've got a son and two daughters. Okay, you are suffering attrition here, which is not ideal. Let's get there. I can put you on force march if necessary. Nope. All right, so well, Tredulia actually got bigger.
So you're currently at war with uh, Revolt there. Let's do it. I'm not going to care that much about uh, really quickly getting... like, a whole bunch of other stuff. Let's get in there. Oh, can't control you. Let's see uh, how things go. Uh, I am worried about all of those guys up there. Because I don't have a whole lot going on. But if I can, like, hit these guys pretty quick, then I'm hoping that I can just grab it all. Uh, we're going to go for the National Unrest again. Got a gift from Celticia Maiorius. Uh, please tell me that you're not already locked in. Shoot. Uh, let's keep you not like that. And you're going to help out, which is fine. Yeah, that's dumb. That that just trashed that one army. Consolidate down to a single horse for now. Get all the way up there. Actually, get all the way up there so you're, like, <laughs> way away from it. Come down there. Independent operations and independent operations. Let's see if you actually decide to do anything. No. All right. Well, let's see. Oh, I'm not actually. war with those guys. thought I was going to be. Well, that's fine, then. Not sure exactly where you're going to end up going there. Galaxy City State of Narbonensis. Sure. They're actually not doing anything right now. Which is perfectly fine by me. Okay. Defeated them. We can get uh, Fort Defense, Trireme Discipline, National Tax, National Commerce Income, I think is going to be more worthwhile. 
take that. Okay. Succeeded there. Any chance that you're going to come up here and attack them? Because that'd be really, really nice. Okay, just uh, completely wiped out that uh, fresh unit of uh, 1,000 heavy infantry. It's very nice. I like it. Uh, oh, yeah, you are just a new, probably rebellious country. something up this, uh, up that way. Uh, after weeks of nervous looks and smirks at court, the whispers circling the palace have finally reached the ears of the king. It seems that someone has been spreading rumors and spinning yarns of her unequaled profligacy and unfitness for the throne. The damage has been done. Now all look to how the king will deal with the situation. Uh, and I have no choice in the matter. I don't know why. Okay, that's unfortunate. But we have taken that one. So that's going to flip. Let's come up through there. Let's turn a force march on you. that. Okay. Let's get up there. Where are you going? Ah, you... Oh, you are going to unsiege that. Okay. I suppose that's okay-ish. Okay. We actually have pretty much what we want out of this, I think. Tempted to wait for this to fall, though. Might be able to do something with these guys. I can make you a feudatory. Perfect. Because he had a lot of troops, and I don't think I slaughtered them. So these one province guys are pretty good for uh, getting feudatories and stuff like that. Um, might be able to knock Platonesia out. Nope. Alright, Elbacoria. You know what, Elbacoria? I don't really care about that. You just take all that.
Take some money. I mean, the problem that I, I'm kind of faced with is that a lot of these other guys are going to just start... You know, they're just going to keep joining in with these uh, wars. But... They're not going to be joining in with uh, Carthage. And with this, all I have left is Carthage. So there we go. We take this. Uh, banish those of class. Put the rest of the sword. Okay, you come out there. Come here. Might as well come up here. Come over here. You're okay there, you're okay there, although I should probably move you out here just to be on the safe side. Alright, so, um... Unrest. Got some bad spots. Unhappy pops. Oh. Why are, is, are there unhappy pops? Like, they're not occupied anymore. Let's let a month pass by. Okay, good. That has gone away. We have an issue here. Starving city. That should go away soon. Starving city should go away soon. And just unhappy pops. Fix that. Alright. Okay, and then if we just do that... Should be okay for a while. Set our stuff down so that we're making money again. And we got a civic advance. Embaria. Yeah, that's fine. You can have that. Okay, trade route here. What could we get? We could get some wine. Or grain. You already have grain, so let's just do wine. Up here. We've got grain as well. I'd rather look for some place that grain would benefit, like down... Well, you already have grain. You don't have grain. Okay. That's pretty good. Uh, what do we have surplus in our capital? Yeah, we just have the uh, one leather, one wood, so I don't want to do anything there. Alright, so, um, yeah, it's basically going to be prepping for combat against Carthage. Do not know where their fleet is. All right, but we're going to be taking it easy for probably years um, just to try to st stock up on manpower because they're not actively in war right now. Uh, I will give you that, and 
Oskia. I will give you that. And that's fine. I like you guys a little bit right now. <laughs> no, not you, though. Sorry. Sucks to be you. You're my disloyal general. He raised his own army. Nope. And there's a military advance. So that puts us at uh, 15 across the board. 13, 14, 14, 14. So we are definitely staying well ahead of Carthage, which is good. On the other hand, Carthage is not attacking anyone right now, which I'm kind of surprised that they're not moving in here. I mean, they lost land here, which is kind of shocking. There's multiple Lucanias all over the place. And another daughter was born. Egypt is uh, being super stable. They're not... They're not colonizing, though. They're romantic. seen that before. I thought it was just Egyptian and uh, Meroitic. Where are they based out of? Oh well. Alright, I got a new invention, but uh, let's take a look to see if there is anything uh, that we can set up a trade route for. Other than wood and leather. And it seems like the answer is no. Alright. That's fine. Uh, build roads cost. Minus 25%. You know what? I have not been doing that. I think I can do that now. I can. After Duly Occidentalis Civil War ends, don't care. Yeah, we'll get a nice change on building roads in the uh, upcoming patch as well, but... Uh, Governor of Contestania. Down here. Okay, do we have any scorned families? Yes. Research points plus 10. Uh, we'll take that. So this is part of our land out here, the, uh, the Balearic Islands. It's part of this region. Uh, our physician has died in a freak accident. Physician failed to heal thyself. Um... Hmm. Doesn't look like we're getting any good. Scorned families. Um, also, let's turn off employed. 
Turn off Imprisoned. And we probably do have some good people that we could grant citizenship to. games. Uh, I don't think there's any anyone here that's you're at 12, you're 12, you're 12, you're 11. I got nothing there. All right. But uh, government wise, Royal Tudor, you are Celtiberian Druidic. You're of the right culture, but the wrong religion. Jeez. Okay, now we'll stick with that guy for the royal tutor. I'll have you for the, a little while. Not that that matters that much, but... We can always swap you off to be a, uh, a general later. Okay, let's see. Probably going to want to do a big push into there. So let me get you over here. Let's get you there. So we're going to want to take that stuff. Um, going to need some other people over there as well. So you come over there. You. So we're going to push in there. We're going to want to push through here. that I can do anything with. Friend of the general, friend of the marshal, you're nothing. You're a general, and there's nothing I can do about that. Okay. That's all fine. And he falls ill again with dysentery. Let's go ahead and seek treatment. All right, but it is about time to end the episode. When we come back next time, we are going to continue to um, build up our manpower. I would, I think, I would like to have a hundred thousand before we do this, because we're gonna, it's, we're gonna suck a lot of it pretty quick. Um, but I kind of suspect most of their armies are over here. Uh, we are gonna need to to have some, actually some big stacks ready to just go in and trash these guys would be good. Um, I think I lost that one army that had no troops in it. So we're at 173 cohorts at the moment. I will definitely want to make some more armies. Uh, I can't do anything with you. You're moving, and you're moving. Alright. But, uh, yeah, that will be next time. See you then, everyone.